So quite often I'm asked, how do you use these angled planishers or what the heck are they even for um, specifically for curves on the outside? For me, this is how I use them. I'm using them somewhere in an area like this. So here I have the angled planisher, flat on one side, round on the other. It's very aggressive, so you're really using it for uh, fast work. You're using it for finishing work, something that you are not looking at spending a ton of sculpting time on after you've used it. You could do all you want beforehand, and all I'm doing is going right through those sides here. Okay, and I'm just going to start on the inside and work my way out. of the hammer. Let's find out. Alright, I lied. I'm not going to start on the perfect inside because I don't have the angle for it with the camera in the way, but I'm just going to start outside of it. So essentially what I'm doing is creating a decently planished inside line. And what that does is give me quite a bit of access to planish what is now the uh, available wall. You can see how how much shape we got obviously needs cleanup. But now I can come in with some smaller lighter tools and work the available wall and clean those up. And I would carry that tool further and I would probably do one more lighter pass with a lighter hammer just to you know make sure it was as clean as possible. Um, on the other side have it have it started as well so hopefully that gives you a sense of direction for these things now you can also use them inside little curls I have a very small one that I made just to just to fit right in that curl right there and I, I will then take it through each one of these Makes a lot of work, pretty quick. You know, I'm, I'm not a, I'm not a big, like shortcut guy, but sometimes you don't need more than that. All right. Well, thanks very much, and let me know if that was helpful. Um, I'm gonna keep working along on this guy. I sort of need to finish him in only a few days, where the first line I made. I think I had about five months of work into it that I spread out over a year. So it is moving pretty quick though, and I'm not going to go as detailed as I did the other one. So helps that it's smaller. All right, thanks very much, guys. Hope that helped.